This is a flow and power consumption test for inch and a half plumbing with a one and a half horsepower variable speed pump and a 150 square foot cartridge filter. We're going to be using a single inch and a half suction line and a single inch and a half return line. We'll be monitoring flow with this digital flow meter as well as this analog flow meter as well. So let's go ahead and get started here. We're already running at 500 RPM. Take a look. Just over 11 gallons per minute. And the power consumption there. So the numbers to watch here are the ones in the top right corner. That is the wattage, 63 watts. The amperage on the left hand side, 0.8. Uh, the power supply, 230 volts AC for this particular test. So as you can see, only 63 watts at 500 RPM. Just over 16 and a half. Still under 100 watts, 90 watts, 90 and a half. 0.86 amps. Just under 23 gallons per minute there. Now we're up over 100. Just under 130 watts, 129 watts, approximately one amp. That's just under 30 gallons per minute, 28 and a half gallons per minute, 180 watts. And if you have, you know, not everyone has a digital flow meter. These are much more common here. And so you would read it at the top of the float there. And so you would read that at approximately, or if I were reading that, I would read that at about, I don't know, 29 gallons per minute. That's what it would look like to me. Thirty, just under 35 gallons per minute, 251 watts, 1.37 amps. Just under 41 gallons per minute, 354 watts, 
just under 47, 46 and a half, no, just under 47 gallons per minute. Four hundred and eighty-eight watts. Just under fifty-three. Six hundred and sixty, six hundred and sixty watts, six hundred and sixty. That's some fluctuation. I'll call it six hundred and sixty three. Just under 60 gallons per minute there, and about 880 watts. I'm taking a look here, you can see just under 60 gallons per minute. Just under 66 gallons per minute. 1.14 kilowatts or 1,140 watts. The decimal point moved on that one there. Uh, just over 5 amps current draw. Seventy one point three gallons per minute, one point four four kilowatts, just about six and a half amps. Just under 78 gallons per minute. 1.81 kilowatts, just over 8 amps. It's about 8.1 amps. This will be maximum speed now. Eighty two and a half gallons per minute, two point one five kilowatts, two thousand one hundred fifty watts, just under ten amps, nine point six five amps. So that's reading. Just over 14, like probably 14.2 or so PSI. If you found this information helpful, please be sure to like this video and subscribe to my YouTube channel. And you can check out my website, swimmingpoolsteve.com.